Hey, what is going on guys? I'm the Explosive Gamer and welcome to my non-spoiler review of Transformers Age of Extinction. I decided to be coming with one of these and I have it. So, start things off, this movie was amazing. It was, it was great, it was one of my most favorites of all of them, but I still think the first one was the best. Just saying, the first one was the best of the four. Even though this one blows all of them out of the water, the first one was the best. This movie, to me, was... You know, better than the last two. Better than three and four. I mean, three, and, two and three, but still not as good as one. It was longer than one. It had more, uh, like more characters. I get like human characters and more relatable characters, but it was, still did not have the best way of everything to go on. Anyway, the beginning of the movie here was 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 very slow. Um, it wasn't too slow, but it, you know, it was it was fairly slow to the point of me. Going, okay, let's go, let's get to the action, and then that would happen, that can actually one happen. It's not like you don't have to wait for the action too long, it just it just gets to the point of being slow. Um, anyway, uh, Galvatron and Stinger, we already know, were made by the humans. They are some of, they are so cool, man. Just saying, they are cool. Um, Galvatron is, is a cool character, just saying. He, he is the some of the coolest, uh, way, the way he's played out through the movie is really cool, and how they show him towards the end is also really cool, but, uh, you guys who haven't seen it, I don't want to spoil it for you, I'm not going to say anything else about it, and Stinger doesn't have any lines at all, he doesn't say anything, just saying. Um, so something I learned that, uh, that was kind of guessed when the toys came out is Drift, he's a triple changer, he does turn into a helicopter, there was a helicopter toy of Drift that came out that was a remold of Skyhammer. It actually is. He is a triple changer. He is a Bugatti and a helicopter. It's cool and weird at the same time, but it, it adds for spots in the movie that uh, help out. It's pretty cool. Um, the characters in this movie were very well well written, I think, uh, compared to some of the other ones. They were better written than three, I gotta say, and they're a hell of a lot better written than two. Um, and the, there, were, there was a good mix of both comedy and action and also the, the suspense and drama. There was a good amount of all that stuff. Um, I, I, it, it's, 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 it's fun. I did, I did like this movie a lot. I don't, I don't want to... The reason why I'm hesitating and saying all this stuff is I do not want to put anything out that will ruin the movie for you. Um, anyway, so at the end of this movie... They left a huge availability and opening for Transformers 5 if they want to make it. If not, they can just leave it like that and they'll be done. It is, it is it's a great ending, but also a huge cliffhanger. Um, anyway, but it was one of my, like I said, one of my most favorites. I will go see this over and over and over. When it comes out, I'll watch it over and over and over. And I cannot wait to see it again. Hope you guys all enjoyed. If you haven't seen it yet, I do recommend you go see it. I, I'm gonna go eight, eight, nine out of ten out of my personal rating. I don't, I don't got anything better than that that I can really give to it. Maybe, maybe, maybe nine and a half. Maybe, probably not. I'm gonna give it an eight and a half. Eight and a half out of ten. Anyway, hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, go see this movie. It is a very good movie, and I'll see you all later. Peace out.